Welcome back historians. Today we are going to talk about early humans as well as the agricultural revolution. The early period of human history is called the Stone Age. That's when people made tools and weapons from stone. The earliest part of the Stone Age is the Paleolithic Age. The Paleolithic Age began about 2.5 million years ago. It lasted until about 8000 BC. The first humans spent most of their time looking for food. They hunted animals and gathered, or collected, plants, nuts, and berries. For this reason, early people are known as hunter-gatherers. Early people moved from place to place looking for food. People who move from place to place in order to survive are called nomads. In the Paleolithic age, men hunted the large animals. They learned how animals behaved. They learned the best way to hunt them. At first, men used clubs to kill the animals. They also drove animals over the edge of cliffs. Over time, Paleolithic people created better tools and weapons. These new traps and spears made hunting easier. Paleolithic women spent most of their time looking for food. They gathered berries, nuts, and grains from woods and meadows. They also took care of the children. Technology is the use of new ideas and tools to do work. Technology was first used by Paleolithic people. They made tools and weapons from flint. Flint is a hard stone with sharp edges. Paleolithic people made sharp knives and axe heads from flint. Paleolithic people were able to adapt, or change, in order to survive. They lived in caves that protected them from bad weather and from wild animals. In places where it was cold, they made clothes from animal skins. During the Paleolithic age, people learned how to make fire. Can you imagine how hard life was before that? Once people had fire, they could eat cooked food. They had light at night. Fire also provided warmth and scared away wild animals. Early people probably made fire by creating friction. They rubbed two pieces of wood together until the wood became so hot it caught on fire. They also started fires by hitting one stone against another. This would create a spark that could set dry grass or leaves on fire. Other advancements took place during the Paleolithic age. During this time, people developed spoken language. Before this, humans communicated through sounds and hand motions. Spoken language made it easier for people to work together. Just like language today, the language of early people was constantly growing and changing. Just like today, new ideas and new technology required new words. Early people expressed their ideas through language. They also expressed themselves through art. Early artists painted the walls of their caves with paints made from crushed rock mixed with animal fat. Early cave paintings show animals in bright colors. Some of the Paleolithic Age achievements include Improved technology Flint tools and weapons Animal skin clothes Ability to make fire Spoken language Cave art About 100,000 BC Earth began to get very cold Thick sheets of ice moved across much of the land. Early people had to adapt, or change, if they were to survive. This was the beginning of Earth's most recent ice age. Ice ages are long periods of extreme cold on Earth. During the ice ages, more and more ice formed on the Earth. The levels of the oceans dropped because so much water was taken from the oceans to form the ice. Land that was once covered by water was now above it. One place this happened was between Asia and North America. During the Ice Ages, a land bridge connected the two land masses. A land bridge is a strip of dry land that was once covered by water. People could now walk from Asia into the Americas. The last Ice Age ended about 10,000 years ago. The climate on Earth became warmer and the ice melted. People began to stay in one place. They started to grow grains and vegetables. People also began to domesticate, or tame, animals. This was the beginning of systematic agriculture, or farming. Farming slowly replaced hunting and gathering as the main source of food for people. This change in the way people lived marked the start of the Neolithic Age. The Neolithic Age began about 8000 BC and ended about 4000 years later. 
agriculture was the biggest change that took place during the Neolithic age. This change happened very slowly. The switch from hunting and gathering to farming is called the agricultural revolution. Once humans learned how to grow crops and tame animals, their lives became very different. There was a steady supply of food. The population, or the number of people who live in a place, grew. People stopped moving around to look for food. They began to live in settled communities. These changes took place around the world. Neolithic people settled in villages made up of permanent homes. Villages and homes had shrines, or holy places where gods and goddesses were honored. Neolithic people grew fruits, nuts, and different grains. Sheep, goats, and cattle were also raised. Some Neolithic people hunted and fished. Early settled communities often had more and better food than nomads. Better food led to healthier people. Healthier people lived longer and had more children. The population grew. More people could grow more crops. Eventually, farmers grew more food than they could eat. They began to trade food for things they could not make themselves. People began to do work other than farming. They could do tasks that matched their talents. This is called specialization. Some people made jewelry or weapons. Others made pottery or wove cloth. These people also traded their products for goods they did not have. In Neolithic communities, most men were farmers. They grew the food and protected the village. Women took care of the children and wove cloth for clothing. People continued to make advancements. In Western Asia, people discovered that mixing tin and copper created bronze. Bronze was stronger than copper. Bronze tools and weapons were better than those made of stone. Bronze became widely used between 3000 and 1200 BC. This period is known as the Bronze Age. By the beginning of the Bronze Age, four great civilizations had appeared in river valleys. These civilizations were Mesopotamia, Egypt, India, and China. These civilizations were far apart. But they had things in common. They developed in river valleys. The rich soil in river valleys made it easier to grow crops. Rivers provided fish. Rivers also encouraged trade. Increased trade led to the development of cities. Cities became the centers of civilization. People formed governments. Governments protected their people and food supplies. The first governments were monarchies. A monarchy is a government led by a king or a queen. Monarchs made laws to keep order. Religion became more complex. Priests performed ceremonies to win the approval of gods and goddesses. Rulers claimed that their own power rested on the support of these powerful beings. Rulers claimed that their own power rested on the support of these powerful beings. People were organized into social classes. The classes were based on the type of work people did and the amount of wealth or power they had. Rulers and priests belonged to the highest class. Below this class were farmers and craftspeople. Enslaved people formed the lowest class. During this time, written language developed. Early writing used symbols. People in early civilizations also produced art. They created paintings and sculptures. They built huge buildings, such as places of worship or burial tombs for rulers. Thank you for watching and happy learning.